Hello, Beth. Mark Alderman from Alderman Chevrolet Buick GMC, Vermont's favorite car dealership, where we're best known for awesome deals and fabulous service. Beth, thanks for inquiring about this new arrival. It's a 2014 Chevrolet Traverse LS. Eight passenger, six cylinder, all wheel drive sport utility vehicle. Has just under 100,000 miles and it's just reduced to $12,027. Finished off in a silver metallic. Coming around, you've got 17 inch wheels. Coming around the front, high intensity front headlamps, that iconic dual port Chevrolet grille. Now, when we take a close look here, one of my favorite things about this vehicle is the color with the silver metallic. If you take a close look at the windshield here, this vehicle is actually quite dirty. It just came off the lot, but when you step back, it looks sparkling clean. It looks like it was just washed. So it's a great color for not showing the dirt. Now, very affordable, very affordably priced at $12,027. Uh, offers a lot of value. When we take a closer look here, we've got, um, I'm not sure if they're new, but they look brand new. Set of Goodyear Frontera or Forterra tires. And if you take a close look at the tread on those, gosh, they look brand new. Lots of tread on those. Um, wheel covers in very good condition. Take a look at the body down the side here. That looks terrific. And again, we'll take a look at the rear wheels. And you can see those look near new as well, if not brand new. Take a look at the condition of this wheel cover. That looks great. Now, one of the other things I like about this vehicle, this platform is front wheel drive first and it engages the rear wheels on demand. Uh, it's all seamless. You don't have to shift it to get into all-wheel drive. And one of the things that we've learned about this vehicle through the years, you would be hard-pressed to find a vehicle that performs better in messy, uh, messy conditions or snowy conditions. It's really terrific uh, here in the winters in the North Country. Now, taking a look at the interior, I apologize, it's a little bit dark here, but... Uh, You've got the uh, three passenger middle row and a three passenger rear seat. Both are 60-40 split folding seats and these fold flat. So depending on your combination of people and cargo, you've got a lot of flexibility there, a lot of different solutions. Go ahead and raise this up here. And when we take a closer look at the inside, from a condition perspective, I see very few signs of any wear and tear. Got a nice uh, center armrest there that can flip down. It's got a couple of cup holders there. Take a look at the front of the vehicle. You see this nice dual cockpit design, very contemporary looking. Steering wheel controls for the driver information center and the audio system. Nice clean looking center stack. I love the two-tone on the dash that wraps around with the metallic ex accents. Take a closer look at the front here. Look at the driver door controls for condition. See those all look nice and sharp. The sill plate looks really good. It's got WeatherTech flat mat, uh, floor mats, laser cut to fit. Look at the upholstery. This is the this takes the most amount of wear and tear of any place on the vehicle. That all looks to be really good shape. You've got two different types of fabric. You've got a more breathable fabric on the interior or on the touch points, more durable fabric on the bolsters, exterior. Um, really a sharp looking interior. Hard to see as dark as it is outside. And the center console is pretty neat. It's got some different solutions here. You can slide this back out of the way and you've got a section there and then that comes out and there's hidden storage deep down in there. This tray here is cut out to hold your coins and things. This has Bluetooth for your phone, by the way. And then this folds up for, or lifts up for more storage. 
really generous sized glove box over here. Two cup holders and some additional storage over here. Uh, this also has a rear camera. Let's see if I can show that to you here. Really nice cabin experience when you close that door. You can see there the rear camera, and then when you turn the wheel, those guide bars turn with the wheels as well, so you gives you a little bit better indication of where you're going. Let's see. Go ahead and walk around the exterior. I like to look at the lower parts, particularly around the back, you can see. And there's there's a few scratches here just from loading things and stuff, but nothing major at all. There's a release the lift gate right here. You see there's quite a bit of storage. Considering this is eight passenger and all three seats are up, there's a quite a bit of storage. There's some hidden storage underneath here. Quite a bit of storage, um, even with the seats up. And then when we pull, pull these down, you can see that's just with uh, part of the third row down. A lot of different. So again, a lot of room, a lot of flexibility in different options there for how you use that space. It's one of the reasons this vehicle's been so popular through the years. Take a look at this. Again, there's a different perspective on the rear tires. Take a close look at the wheel cover here. Take a look down the body on the passenger side. Take a close look at the passenger side front wheel cover. Again, there's a different perspective on the front tires. So Beth, that's the uh, 2014 Chevrolet Traverse all-wheel drive, eight passenger sport utility vehicle, V6 engine, 288 horsepower, 266 foot-pounds of torque. Beth, if you'd like to learn more, just click the learn more button below. Or if you're on YouTube, there's a link in the comment section. Or come see it for yourself at Alderman Chevrolet Buick GMC, Route 7 South in Rutland.